Grand Seiko's spring drive is arguably the most impressive movement technology of the last 50 years of watchmaking. But what does it all mean and how does it work? After decades of R&D that started back in the 1970s, it wasn't until 1999 when the brand had a workable prototype to show to the public. Its aim was to provide quartz level of accuracy without the need of an external power source like a battery, all while combating the number one enemy of mechanical watchmaking, friction. So how did they do it and how does it work? To put it simply, spring drive uses mechanical power as an energy reserve with the help of a mainspring, which feeds the gear train until it reaches a freely rotating wheel known as a glide wheel. A glide wheel as opposed to a balance wheel is going to rotate eight times per second in one direction to create a small electrical charge with the help of a magnet at its axis in close proximity to copper wire, which in turn is going to send an electrical signal to an integrated circuit and quartz oscillator. The integrated circuit returns as an electromagnetic pulse to the glide wheel, utilizing that copper wire, which acts like a regulating brake without having to even touch the component, making so that the glide wheel only rotates eight times per second. The end result is a movement that is accurate to no worse than plus or minus 15 seconds a month, only getting crazier from there with different variations of spring drive, all while delivering a stellar power reserve, compliance to the ISO 764 standard for magnetic resistance, and showcasing that effortless secondhand sweep that mirrors the singular rotation of the glide wheel. 